Good morning, motor cars. Today is Friday, December 12th, 2014. Uh, end of the year rapidly approaching. We've only got another couple of weeks, less than two weeks till Christmas and three weeks till the end of the year. Hard to believe. Um, we don't have any birthdays today, tomorrow, or Saturday, or Sunday, and no anniversaries today, tomorrow, or Sunday, but we do have a very special birthday on Monday. And since Chuck does word of the day on Mondays, he probably won't mention it because it's his birthday Monday. So when you see Chuck on Monday, be sure to wish him a very happy birthday. Um, on this day in history, in 2000, General Motors announced it'll be phasing out Oldsmobile. That seems like it's hard to believe that, that was 14 years ago. Um, in 1989, Leona Helmsley, also referred to as the Queen of Mean, was sentenced to four-year prison term for tax fraud. She died in 2007, and you might remember that she left $12 million to her dog. Um, in 1970, Tears of a Clown gave Smokey Robinson and the Miracles their first number one pop hit. Just a couple of small items. Um, we are missing a box of deposit slips that were shipped here and delivered here last Friday the 5th. They were delivered by UPS and delivered to the Honda store. So if anybody, it's probably still over at Honda someplace, if anybody over there sees those, could you please return those to Susan in the office? She's been looking for them. It would probably be just a very small box, you know, a four by six size box, or it could be in a uh, plastic green envelope. Sometimes they come that way too. So if you see those, if you could get those to her, we would appreciate that. Um, just wanted to remind all the managers that our forecasts are due Monday the 15th. So if you don't have that completed yet, please work on that and get that done by Monday. As you may remember from the manager's meeting, there are consequences for those that don't have them done. So if you have any troubles with the formulas or the templates or you need any help with, you know, on the expense side or any of that, please see me. I'm happy to help you between now and Monday. Um, end of the year is rapidly approaching. Just wanted to go over a couple of things that we need to get done before the end of the year. We need to clear up all of our receivables, whether they're parts, old parts and service receivables, bad checks, any old warranty claims, any of that kind of stuff. Between now and the end of the year, we want to clear up as much of that as we possibly can. Um, any payable invoices need to be turned into Sydney. Please do that as you get them so she can stay on top of that all month long so we can have a timely close. Um, we need to do physical inventories of our vehicles, both new and used vehicles. So those have to be done by the end of the year. Um, now would be the time to take a look at see if there are any abandoned vehicles on the lot. There's no, so, no snow, so now's a good time to do that. Um, and any open repair orders need to be closed too. So if you have anything like that that needs to be cleared up, if there's anything that any of us in the office can do to help you, we're happy to do that. Um, our end of year is, is a pretty important time. We like to have the books as clean as we possibly can for the end of the year so that when the financial statements are prepared and the accountants come out and take a look at things, things are as clean as possible. They will be coming on the 5th, I believe it's the 15th of January. So that's only a couple weeks after we get the month uh, after the end of the month, so we have to get the month closed, we have to get the year closed, and we have to get all of our books in clean shape so that they're ready for them to come on the 15th. So it's going to be a pretty strong push for us in the office this next month or so. So if you could kind of be cooperative and get all your stuff in as timely as you can, we would certainly appreciate it. That's all I have for today. Have a great weekend and be safe. Thanks, everyone.